Hello everyone, this is Patak and you are watching my channel. So today I will talk about vitamin B7 and in the previous video I talked about vitamin B6 and I hope you really like that video. So please don't forget to like and subscribe my channel so you can also like this video if you want to and you can also follow my Instagram account which I will get for you forever. Okay, so let's get started with this particular presentation of vitamin B7. Okay, so vitamin B7 is known as biotin and it's a water soluble vitamin. Vitamin B7 is also known as biotin is one of the water soluble and highly essential B complex vitamins termed as vitamin H. Where the letter H represents hair and foot. Where, which are the German words for hair and skin. It is pivotal for a wide range of metabolic processes in the body including enzymes synthesis for several crucial metabolic pathways, metabolism of fats and carbohydrates as well as the synthesis of amino acids which are necessary for the protein synthesis. Biotin is synthesized by only bacteria, molds, leaves, algae and certain plants. The human body cannot synthesize biotin on its own and has to depend on external dietary sources to replenish the required amount. It is highly essential in maintaining good hair, skin, and nails. It, is, it improves neural function, helps in the metabolism of nutrients. So, vitamin B7 plays a very crucial role in the metabolism of the body, and it is very much essential for the hair and the skin. Okay, because it is known as vitamin H, and H represents hard and hot, which are the German words for hair and skin. So, obviously, it means that vitamin B7 is very, very important for hair and skin. If you want to improve your hair and skin, please take vitamin B7 in appropriate levels. Vitamin B7 structure, you can see the structure over here. You can see that there's a ketone group, there's a, you know, uh, acidic group also, carboxylic group also, there's a sulfate group also. Okay, so this is the vitamin B7 structure. Vitamin B7 sources, so there are various sources of vitamin B7 if you want to increase your uh, biotin levels and if you want your skin and hair to improve then you can eat almonds. Almonds help in the hair growth and improvement in the skin. You can take mushrooms, you can take cheese, you can take cauliflower, you can take sweet potato, you can take grape. So these are the sources of vitamin B7. Benefits of vitamin B7, so there are various benefits, first one is the healthy skin that I already told you in my first two slides that vitamin B7 is very much important for skin health and hair growth, healthy hair and nails, it is also important for nails, boosts in the immunity, healthy heart and muscle pain relief. Suppose if you're not taking vitamin B7 in an appropriate level, so it will lead to the deficiency of vitamin B7 and it leads to three main deficiencies. One is the hair loss. Obviously, your hair will not grow well and it will not be healthy at all and obviously you will experience hair loss. Muscle aches, as I told you in my previous slide, that vitamin B7 helps in the muscle pain relief. If you're not taking vitamin B7 in an appropriate level, so there will be a lot of muscle aches high blood sugar so if there's a deficiency of vitamin B7 the blood sugar levels will not be regulated in a proper manner and it will lead to a high blood sugar I hope you really like this video please do not forget to like and subscribe my channel and stay safe and healthy bye bye